All right, let's see what happens. Just testing out some new stuff. It's actually on the phone. Let's see what happens. Anyways, so I left a couple of messages with a couple of people, and I just want to briefly detail how, in my experience, what later, later what actually works is three things and I just want you to pay attention. If not, you can let it fly. So basically, the first thing is your sugar intake. If you're a girl, if you're a woman, keep your sugar grams, total grams for the day. It doesn't matter if it's added, sugar, it doesn't matter, just sugar period. So if you're eating oats, and you see one gram or close to a gram, or if you're eating rice, or something that you totally wouldn't think has any sugar whatsoever, count it. So every little thing you put into your body for the day, pay attention to all of it. So if there's like one or two grams in a serving of beans, and you're eating beans, add it all up, tally everything. If you're a woman, keep it under 30 grams. So have it in the 20s. If you're a man, keep it under 35. So have it in the 30s. So your total consumption of any sugar whatsoever for the day. If you're a man, keep it in the 30s or lower. And if you're a woman, keep it in the 20s or lower. That's the first thing. The second is your total fat. So if you're, let's say, a woman or a man, who has a target weight of between, let's say, 150 to 170, or you're a woman, let's say, who wants to be in the 115 to 125 or 130 zone. So if you're a woman who wants to be between, let's say, 110 to 130, then your total fat consumption should be below 50 grams for the day. So just tally that up, every single little thing. So if rice, again, oats, they have like a little three grams of total fat. Um, your milk has a certain amount of total fat. Tally everything up. Things you wouldn't think have fat. Just pay attention to it because it all adds up. So now you take the total. If you're a woman who has a target weight of between 110 to 130, then your total fat grams should be below 50 grams for the day. If you're a man and, or a woman who wants to have your target weight between 150 to 200, then your total fat should be below 90 grams total for the day. And it should ideally be between 50 to 75. So you want to stay below 80 grams total for the day. That's the second thing. The third thing is calories. So you wanna make sure you're intaking enough. So whatever your target weight is, right? Let's say 168 for my height and my bone structure, right? So 168 times 10 means 1680 is my minimum. I should be consuming 1,680 calories. So I should be around 1,700 as a minimum. So it's safe to be between 1,680 to 2,000, just to maintain that weight. So whatever your target weight is, let's say you wanna be, you're a woman, you wanna be 125, right? So that means you should be intaking a minimum of 1,250 for the day, right? Now, that last category, calories, caloric consumption, you really shouldn't be, what's good? You really shouldn't be worried about that as much as the first two things I mentioned, which is your sugar intake should be below 35, I would say in the 30s as a man, and below 30 being a woman. So you should be in the 20s as a woman or less, and as a man, you should be in the 30s or less. That's the most important thing. Second, your total fat. So your total fat, 
technically it is 0.45 of your target weight. 0.45 you times by your target weight. And remember, your target weight calories wise is times 10, whatever your target weight is. That's how you do all three. So the first two things are the most important and I, I can almost assure you, whatever you're doing as far as exercise and diet, if you've, if you've hit like a plateau or a wall and you're wondering like, why am I not getting quicker results? If you pay attention to those first two things I mentioned with the sugar intake, 30s and 20s on the grams, and your total fat between 50 to 75 on the total grams of total fat for the day, and you stay within that range or less, you're going to get immediate results. Your energy is going to shoot through the roof, and you're going to see incredibly fast results as effective as like a week or less. You're going to be like, wow, you're going to see things melting off and it's more powerful than any fat burner that you could take on the market. And this is a hundred percent natural. I've, I've put out other videos where I'm talking about like intermittent fasting, but this right here in my experience, and I've been doing this for a long time, is always the culprit and pay attention to just do the work, tally those numbers and see if I'm not correct on this. Total sugar grams, total fat. Last thing is make sure you're consuming enough calories. Signing off, Soul Infusion.